So obviously nothing earth shattering, but I just wanted to illustrate and just kind of motivate people that, hey, you've got some cans, tuna, you've got some canned salmon. Um, you don't have to run out and go get some keto bowl at Chipotle or something. You can whip this up super quick. Also eating a lot of money. So we were gonna do uh, a salmon salad um, instead of like a tuna salad. And so this red salmon, it has the bones and skin in it. And I'm gonna show you, it looks really disgusting, but once you mix it up, you don't even notice the bones. Um, this is wild Alaskan. Um, I would definitely recommend going for the wild um, and US based. Uh, this is gonna be linked down below to Amazon. I appreciate you guys clicking that. Uh, so thank you for that, but let's get started. So this is a two and a half minute lunch, high fat, super healthy, lots of great stuff in the skin and in the bones that are in this salmon. So at first the salmon definitely looks kind of gross. Don't worry, it's gonna look better once we mash it up. But you can see it's got skin and bones and uh, all of these sort of micro, I guess you could call them micronutrients that are gonna be really healthy for you as opposed to uh, just the flesh because you're getting that extra fat that's in the skin. Um, we're gonna add a little bit of olive oil, harassa sauce. Harassa sauce, if you haven't tried it, is delicious. Um, really unique uh, if you're kind of tired of sriracha or whatever you're using. And this stuff is pretty spicy, so we're just gonna do just a dab. And we'll put a little bit of olive oil on there too to get some extra fat. The salmon is somewhat lean, uh, but there is a, an okay amount of fat in it. And then we're gonna get some mustard and a nice dollop of mayo. And then a pinch of sea salt. This is a Celtic sea salt. I'll link this down below as well. Uh, not all salts are created. And just start mixing all that up. And that's it, just about 20 seconds of mixing and it's looking really good. It's also really easy to customize if you wanna add relish, if you wanna add olives, really whatever's in your fridge, just throw it in, mix it up, and you're getting uh, all that salmon-y goodness.